this is Dutch Productions. Today I'm going to be looking at the custom PC magazines and giving you a review on what they're like. Please be aware these magazines are only for the residents of the United Kingdom. However, there is a website you can visit which is in the sidebar, which has perfect reviews and a forum that you can join. I'm going to be looking at the latest edition of custom PC. As you can see at the top it says February 2010. The positives about this magazine are that the images are crystal clear. Let's find a few examples for you at the moment. Here you can see the review of this graphics card. The image is perfectly laid out on the page, allowing you to clearly see what the image is like. And again, very, very clear images. Also a positive about this magazine is that they give very thorough reviews on whatever they review. This magazine features a host of different products such as motherboards, graphics cards, power supplies and other things like that. And each one they go into specific detail and test it thoroughly. However, there are many po negatives to this magazine. One being the amount of advertising in here. Here is just one example of what's to be expected in the advertising front in this magazine. And on the other page is another example. And another example two pages on. And another example two pages more on. Another example there. I'm surprised how much advertisements there are in this magazine. Then again I'm not. Considering the amount of advertising shows that they ne obviously need the money, like every single magazine does, otherwise they wouldn't be selling it. And, but what's good about these advertisements are they all they are all very computer related, so you do really tend to go on the advertisements and they are of use to you. So that's the positives and negatives. One thing to note, I did say this was a February 2010 version of the magazine, so you can't quite see that. They release these magazines, they seem to give them the date a month after the actual date. So it's December at the moment. And this is two months past. Let's look at some other magazine covers. As we can see here, th look, there's another example of the advertisement. Here is a very clear image of the motherboard. A very clear mock image of an iMac, an ATI Radeon HD 4770, very clear graphic of Grand Theft Auto, Crisis, Warhead and Call of Duty World at War, what seems to be a, uh, a CPU, a close up of a CPU, a PC case, a graphics card, a CPU cooler, a graphics card, a CPU, a case and a motherboard. As you can see, I'm an avid collector of this magazine. However, the images on these magazines are only on here because I'm a subscriber, and subscribers get special editions of these magazines. The normal, like, m magazine that people see in the shops can be seen when you turn two pages in. That's what this, gra this, that's, that is what this magazine would look like if it was on the shelves. But seeing as I'm a subscriber, well, they already know that you know what's inside, so they allow you they allow themselves to publish perfect graphics and other images on the front of their magazine. So yeah, that's been a very quick review of the custom PC magazine series. Thanks for watching Ads Productions.